episodes left, starting with season four. Let's go. Let's fucking go. So I think now we we should be in uh, jail, cause f- that fucking doctor didn't. He didn't come to our side, and the other person, the the gardener, didn't. Previously on The Walking Dead. No! You monsters! Fucking Garcias. I love this part. You, you, you shook my goddamn guts out. <laughs> Joe was in on it. See, that's we what... did it on her orders. I'm sorry. That's why it's I kept him alive. I'm sorry, you backstabbing shitbag. I'll help you. I'll, I'll tell everyone in Richmond about this. <sighs> Maybe he'll be useful. Thank you. Thank you. You can't purely play with I emotions. You gotta play smart. Play smart. Come on, we have to hurry. Wait a second. David told us to come here. He's talking to the others now. Trust me, shit's about to fly. Well, did you say that? I knew I could count on you, brother. This is not over, Joan. I have friends here. Allies. It's a good thing we split up then. I thought it was going to be a trap. What's next? What do we get? I think that's the main reason why I'm playing this game because you get to pick like the outcome. I find that very interesting. This is before everything. Oh, okay. Finally, we get to know his whole backstory. Damn it! Strike one. I'm out of practice. That's all. I was so confused because I haven't held a bat since the league booted me. The people were acting. Well, you got all afternoon to get back in your groove. Like something oh, crazy yeah. happened, but just holding this thing makes me feel better. From what we learned, it's just baseball that he was cheating or something, right? You doing okay? Uh, I've been wrestling with something. Hey! Hey, man, you're Javier Garcia, right? The ball player? Can I get your autograph? <laughs> if you could sign my baseball, that would be so awesome. I, I watch you play all the time. Sure thing, kid. Oh, man! Thank you! Who do I make this out to? No, no, no names. Band players' signatures are worth way more on resale than personalized crap. Just your name is fine. D don't date it or anything. <sighs> oh, hell no. Fuck that. Not for reason. What the hell is this? You want to make money? Get a job. <sighs> Whatever. Yep. Gotta keep those fans happy, big star. Let's get back to baseball. Crush it, swing and miss. Oh, it's out of here. Holy cow. You just had to rub it in, didn't you? Does talking like that make you feel better? Yeah. You should try it. Hey, hey now. <sighs> Son of a bitch. Strike two. If, ben, if he knock that shit off. I'm serious. If he could be toxic to me, Just then talk, I could be talk, toxic talk. to him. Come on. It's annoying. Oh, oh, sorry, David. 
Look, it's cool you're trying to cheer me up. Really. I still can't believe you actually wanted to come here. If I were in your situation, I'd avoid batting cages forever. Well, thanks for bringing me anyway. I needed the distraction. Eh, fuck you, I'm a Christian. Oh, Garcia's on fire! I think your ego's boosted plenty. Next time, we go to the shooting range. Ooh. I don't really shoot. But I do. And I'm good at it. Ow! Fuck! You gotta shut up! <laughs> Stupid thing. Pay more to the door, Pay more. Arms throbbing. Garcia takes one for the team. That's gotta hurt. God damn it, Javi. I fucking warned you. I remember I showed you how to play this game. Well, let this superstar return the favor. Watch this. Yeah, I'm gonna crush it the fuck. Oh my god, the crowd is going wild. I got it. You don't have to rub it in my face. I'm done. Oh, brother. David. David, grow up. Wait, let's talk. David, what's wrong? Come back. I came here to reconnect. Instead, you just want to show me up. Oh my god. What's going on? David, I, I don't understand. You don't understand because you only think about yourself. Toxic. And I'm sick of it. It's been that way for years. You've always been looking out for yourself. You tried to help me. Yeah, let me help you. You really want to help? All right. Drive me down to the recruitment office next week. The army? My job sucks. Kate and I fight like cats and dogs. I belong back in the army. Ooh. I had a purpose there. Do what you gotta do. I had respect. Last time you deployed, you didn't have kids. So, whatever you do now, you gotta put them first. I am putting them first. That's why I have to leave. Mm -mm. Things between me and Kate have been going downhill for a while. But if I left, it seemed like that would be best for everyone. I can't keep the kids are too young. Mom and want. dad will worry. I won't stop you. Not anymore. No, the kids are too young for you to leave them. You got to be around the, you know, coach them on stuff. What the hell do you know about raising children, oh Javi? I'm not gonna lie. If I go, it's gonna be hard on everyone. Yeah, no. Kate may need help from time to time. Oh, what the fuck? You can help, right? You won't leave her hanging. I need to know That's that. That's your response. You can count on me. In my mind. I wish there was like an option where it's like you could pick. Uh, it'll be David's and Javi's responsibility instead of just because if you put you can count on me, it's just I'm taking all the responsibility. But if I put that's your responsibility, it'll be like I'm very, very selfish. And plus, I don't, the game, oh my god. You pick one thing, at least you do a whole different thing, so. It's your family, David, not mine. You gotta stay here to help them. Typical selfish. I knew it. You don't know shit about family. Come on. I want to get out of here now. I mean, even before then, like the events that happened after, get in there. Results in the same I let thing. You go on the road, remember? So at least they just told them straight up. Now? I remember it's why I haven't shot you already. That's how I'm helping you. Jones making a huge mistake. No, you made a mistake when you tried to attack her. Hey, what? everybody just take a breath, all right? I was just trying to tell them. And that's your mistake right there. You can't fight everybody. Understand that Joan's not looking for revenge. She just wants order. Cooperation is the name of the game. There's still a way through this. But you've got to let Joan enforce the laws. I'll... I'll see what I can do. Wait, you're gonna choose that witch over me now? 
better start leaning on your brother, Javi. He needs to get with the program. You boys want to make it out of here. Just relax and trust in the process. This is bad. What are we gonna do? I never trusted Joan. I didn't think she'd turn on me like this. David, hey! I thought I had it handled. All of this is my goddamn fault. I was expecting... I should have seen it coming. But I dropped the ball. Isn't John Warren this? Big time. I'm right here with you, man. We're getting out of this. Together. Thanks. I keep doing this, making the same stupid mistakes. You drove kid away, fight for your family, be strong for Gabe. You're still a hero to Gabe. There's still a lot you can teach him. This world needs all the heroes it can find. That's my boy. Listen to me carefully. I don't care what's gonna happen to me. I'm most worried about Kate and Gabe. They gotta survive, I can't save no matter what. You, don't you don't have to worry. They're safe for now. We have to get them out of town. Both of us. You're right. No matter what we do, Jones already poisoned this well. We've gotta figure a way out of Richmond. All of us? All of us. This time tomorrow, we'll be together and safe. You never give up on anybody. And I'm not going to give up on you. So glad to see you boys getting along. Armed escort? You're that scared to face me? Oh, David. I'm not scared of you. I came here to talk, not fight. You're not going to be a problem, are you? I just want a calm discussion between us. I won't be a problem if you let us go. In fact, I may even be friendly. I'm sorry. I can't do that. <laughs> but I like what you're trying to do. It's sad how we ended up here. But Clinton Lingard agree. You've become a problem. Tomorrow morning, I'm gonna call for a gathering in the square. The people deserve to hear a full explanation of your arrest. Hmm. And then? Then you'll be replaced as head of security. No one's above the law, David. Not even you. I know the laws, Joan. You're the one breaking them. You might be. Your scheme is gonna blow up in your face. You just wait. I really hope not. I'm responsible for the lives of everyone in this community. You set me up. Everyone's gonna see through your lies. I did what I had to do to keep the people of Richmond safe. They're going to see that. And they'll also see that the biggest threat to them right now is you. We'll debate all of this in the morning. Right now, David, I need to ask you some questions in private. Bring him with us. Hmm. Okay. Huh? Screw this. Gotta get out of here. Could squeeze through there. Oh, <laughs> no. Need like a tool for that. Ugh, nothing useful here. Alright, what else do we got? Stand on. Okay. Ooh. What's that? Shower faucet. Well, that's about the kind of day I'm having. Okay. Yeah, let's get that. Oh, there we go. What else do we got? Chair, can I pick that up? No. Pipe. Yeah, let's. Let's 
Yeah. It's my weapon right now. That doesn't look very sturdy. Anything else? I think that should be all of it. No. No. Okay. Hmm. I'm not gonna get up there from this bench. Uh. How am I supposed to go through that though? Oh fuck! Where did they take Dad? I don't know yet. Help me get out of here. These bars are loose. Help me pry them off. I help you? What the I fuck? I can't do it. Can you help? Oh my! God. Nice work, Gabe. Now give me a hand. Cool. I feel like if I was to break into the door, there would be a guard out there. It's a herd. They're outside the walls. This way. Come on. Kate didn't want to stay at Dad's house. Where are you taking me? Eleanor found a place. She sent me to find you. She got a bell on her. So well, they hide out. Thank God for Eleanor. She's a lifesaver. She saved Kate, and I'll never forget it. I was pretty scared. Me too, buddy. Me too. We should probably keep moving. I can't believe you found me. I looked everywhere. Huh. Nice work. Thank you. They still got your dad, though. He's gonna be okay, right? Is he finally growing I mean, up? These are his people. They're just arguing, aren't they? They wouldn't do anything to him. He's negotiating with them now. He'll work it out. Let's just see what happens, okay? All clear. Come on. Wait, what happened to Clementine? Kate keeps pushing us to leave. You have to make her stay. We have to stay until Dad's. Yeah, ready. she just walked away. We can't leave Dad here. Just okay, I'll talk to her. Not after we found him again. I'll talk to her. I'll try to convince her. Good. It's important. Hold up. Everything's gone wrong here, hasn't it? We should be safe in this town. You shouldn't be a prisoner. We'll fix it for us when we get your dad back and our family back together. Okay. That's Eleanor's place. We made it. Great. Let's get in there. close yeah this wasn't so busy before what are they up to come on let's get inside do you probably know I escaped looking for me or something
thinking hard about this, and I really think we should be a thing. I'm sorry. I don't know if I feel like that. Damn. That way. Look. I just don't know. You still mad at me? I really miss you, cool way. You still pissed at me? Just shut up while I'm hugging you. I just can't do this now. Damn. Oh. Kyle's getting rejected. Hey. Uh, hey. Trip, look who's here. Hey, guys. Uh, hey. <laughs> where have you been? Damn, poor Kyle. Joan threw me and David in jail, if you can believe it. Great. So you gave these people more reason to hate us. What is going on here in Richmond? You know more about this place than the rest of us. What do we do? We just can't trust Joan. She's trying to remove David from power by pinning murders on him. Told you we couldn't trust him. I'm sorry about what's going on with David, but we should have gotten out of here when we had the chance. We still need to get out of here, Javi. Let's go. We need a plan. We almost got caught last time, when we just made a run for it. Have you guys even looked out the window? Go look for yourself. Oh. Oh, shit. shit. Javi, even if you did get your brother free, you're not going to be able to go anywhere. Look at that. We should have left when we had a chance. Now we're stuck here. At least we're all still together. Look, this isn't a glass half full situation. It seems like we're in danger within this place and without. I, for one, would feel a whole lot safer with a few more guns to protect ourselves. That the smartest move to make right now? That's crazy. We better be safe. We can't talk. He's my brother, Kate. I have to. Okay. We have to rescue David. Damn straight we do. And we might have to face those muertos. I know where there's guns. My dad showed me. There are lots. The armory. Good idea. A small group should go. Okay. Sounds like a plan. We'll get back here as soon as we can. Good luck. Come here. Kate, I... Just be careful. Look, Javi, I, I don't know if you heard us, but I think I fucked it up with Eleanor. We can talk on the way. I, about that, I, I don't think I can leave this apartment with things like this between me and her. It's just not right. I know you must have at least heard something. It happens, especially these days. Don't worry about it. Thanks. Just shouldn't have pushed it with her like I did. Wasn't fair. Too much going on already, right? Javi, come on. Just give us a minute, pal. I'm sorry, buddy. I just I don't know what to do. Get over it. Give it time for all your hurt. Just follow your heart. That's all any of us have left anymore, right? Thanks, man. Come on, Kyle. I'll talk it over with Eleanor and watch over things here. You've got my word. I won't let anything happen to anyone. Thank you. Javi, come on. Good luck. Come on, Kyle. Go clap those cheeks for me. Stay frosty, gents. What's that mean? Like, stay cool, buddy.
Looks like Bob's on duty. I'll distract him away from the door and meet you inside. Be careful in there. There might be more of them. Remember what I said about staying cool? I've done this before, Hobby. No, you haven't, Gabe. Not really. Some decisions, you make them in a split second, and then have to carry them the rest of your life. You understand? <sighs> yeah, I think I do. How can we trust Ava that she won't turn us in? Can we really trust her? I don't trust her David Rothschild. Your father trusts her. And we trust him, right? Yeah. Then we should be okay. I hope. How do you know when you can trust someone? I feel like I've never really known anyone. To trust you, Other than you and Kate. There's no point. Ariana. Through their actions, they can try to confuse you with their words, but someone worth your trust does good things. Makes sense. Yep. I think we're up. She sure is a big help. Ava said it'd be this way. It's down here. The guns are through that door. Locked. No time to look for a key either. to do this the hard way. Holy fuck, that shit's low. Shotgun ammo. Ooh. My bad. AKs. Put these in your bag. Viper, oh, we never done this before. Just you and me. We make a pretty good team, right? The uncle nephew one two punch. Yeah, we do. Oh, <gasps> <laughs> sorry to scare you. When we get back to Eleanor's, we need to talk to those people about doing the right thing by this place. I'll meet you at the entrance. Why am I not carrying guns? Oh, fuck. Come here. Get away from me! Oh, fuck. 
Are you okay? Oh my god. Morning, kid. It's been better. What the fuck, yeah? Not dead yet. I'm so sorry. Jeez, I can't leave you guys alone for two minutes, can I? He's still alive? Yeah. Just passed out. Starting to think siding with you might have not been the best idea. Toss Sleeping Beauty in the closet so nobody sees him. Oh, fuck. Let me see that wound. It's really bleeding. You're gonna need that taken care of. Shit. No, it's okay. Lingard and David are close friends. We can count on him to help you. Medical facilities right nearby. It'll be quiet this time of night, too. Okay, but let's be quick. Can they really hit targets over a mile away? Not these, but some models. Javi, it's probably best if Lingard doesn't see these guns. He and David might be tight, but he's still part of Richmond's leadership council. I'll keep watch with Ava. Okay. Do any of them have laser sights? <laughs> Clem? Javi, what happened to you? Ran into a little trouble. Wow, that looks like it must have hurt. I just need to get it cleaned up. You surprised me. Thought you were someone else. Looking for something? Sort of. I know this looks bad, but it's not like... It's not like what? I'm just here to talk to Lingard about where AJ is now. Anyway, I can't leave Richmond with that herd out there. Something tells me Lingard doesn't care what you're doing. He's been out of it since I got here. He's alive. Poor dumb bastard. That's gonna need more than just cleaning, Javi. I can stitch that for you. I can't promise it'll look great once it heals. It's better than nothing, though. All right. Go for it. But if I lose my arm, that's on you. Ha ha. You'll be fine. I've dealt with worse. Huh. Let me see if I can find a needle and thread for that. Clem. What the fuck was that? Are you okay? I'm fine. I started bleeding. I know, it's a thing. I've traveled with women before, and, and they all had it. Oh. What is it? I mean, like, why is it... Just don't understand. It means you're growing up, blossoming into your, you know, like, womanhood. Your body is, is developing, and then things change, but it, it'll be okay. Okay. I can take you back to Kate. She can help you with, uh... Javi, worry about yourself right now. We need to find a needle and thread to stitch you up first. Oh, uh, right. <sighs> Wake up! Talk to me! <laughs> wow. That guy is really out of it. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Jackpot. Needle and thread. All sterilized and ready to go. Cody. Hmm. Not much left. It looks like painkillers are in high demand. I wouldn't steal any medicine if I were you. It really doesn't go over well. No thanks. Penicillin. Not what I'm looking for. Okay.
Here we go. What's that? Capsule bottle. Just pills. Is that everything? Yeah. Hey, this is just what you're looking for. They help you handle it. Kate will take care of you. I think I remember how to do this. <sighs> okay, hold still. Try not to breathe. Look, I know I'm probably not the best person to talk to about that stuff before. You weren't that bad. Thanks for, you know, being here. Basically, all this means is you could become a mom, if you wanted. Funny. I already felt like a mom. Jane said I was more of a mom than she'd ever be. Oh. I thought we were completely done with that side of the story. This stinks. Literally and figuratively. At least this is the last of them. From here on out, we have house to ourselves. Sounds nice, right? Now we just need some disinfectant. Get that smell out of there once and for all. Sounds great. Just you, me, and the goofball. Of shit Kenny was capable of. Carver deserved what was coming to him, of course, but that's just brutal. I don't know how you could even watch that. It must have been brutal. Those people, the sounds you know, he must have made. Have Ugh. He did so many bad things to so many people. I wanted to see him suffer for it. Let's get out of here. Never want to look at that sick fuck's body again. Here, take a load off. I've got the little goofball. Hope he hasn't eaten too recently. He hasn't. Good. The last thing I need is to be covered in puke again. Don't puke on me, kid. You hear me? Remember what I taught you. Sweep and stab. Oh, fuck. Come on, we can get out this way. You know, I was pretty worried about you back there. But I guess I didn't need to be. You had things handled. I had... Like usual. That's because I learned from the best. I'm glad you're okay. If 
only Rebecca could see you two together. You guys don't even need me. They just get in the way. You're more than capable on your own. You proved that back there. You're family. We're all family. Rebecca would feel the same way. Thanks, Clem. Go on, take him. He wants his other mom. Thanks, Clem. We'll always have each other. As long as we have that, we'll be okay. All that just to have her kill herself. Oh my god. Whoa there, Clem. It's just me. Why was she sneaking around? What the fuck? What the hell do you want? I'm really glad I found you. Clementine, I know this is hard. I'm so sorry about what happened with AJ. Really, I, I am. What happened wasn't easy for any of us. Tell me he's okay. Please. He's as good as he can be. Which isn't great. Look, it's not much, but... Here. David wanted you to have that. AJ drew it just after you... This... Thank you. You're welcome. Consider it a peace offering? We care about you. Just try to remember that even if it feels wrong, people can still be trying to do the right thing by you. Listen, it's dangerous out here, and right now, you're hurting. Whatever you do, you can't let what happened get to you. You need to keep a level head. Plan for after that. You're strong, but that won't get you far if you don't know what you're doing. I can make it on my own, just like I always have. I don't need anybody else. I don't blame you. Just don't overestimate what you're actually capable of. For me, staying alive has always been about finding people I could trust as much as they trusted me. That's what the new frontier has been. A silver lining. Made me feel worth a damn. Kept me going in the worst of times. You'll find yours. I know you will. Someone or something. I used to have Lee. You never mentioned him. He took care of me for a while. Every time I would look at AJ, I could hear him in my head, helping me. Guiding me. Damn. He's still with you, you know. Here. So is AJ. From the first time we met, right here, surrounded by absolute hell. You and AJ were a light in the darkness. Hope for a better mm. world. That's who you are. Promise me you'll never lose that light. Please. It's what makes you special, Clem. Okay, I promise. You're a tough kid. 
don't change. <sighs> I should get back before anyone notices I'm gone. I know you said you'd get by on your own, but if you find yourself needing supplies, or just someone to talk to, there's an old airfield about ten or so miles south of here. Prescott. There are good people there. I'm sure they'll help you out. I'll miss having you around, Clem. I mean, she didn't really do You're anything. Going to be okay. Thanks, Ava. Against me. Good luck out there, Clem. That's what keeps me going. There's things I have to stay alive to do. <sighs> so, what do you think? I think I'm getting better. I owe you one. Add it to the pile. <laughs> Still have to ask Lingard about AJ. <sighs> Hello, Clementine. Javier. Thought you were rotten in a cell with David. There any chance he got out too? I hate to think about what Joan might do to him. Despite all her pleasantries, she's a cruel bitch. There's a chance, but I don't know how good it is. They separated us, and I don't know where they took them. Figures. You... You were lucky, that's all. When Joan wants something, she... She gets it. Can't say the same for me. Why do you care if David got out? He deserves what's coming to him. If you think that, you don't know David. I know he's the reason I lost AJ. When AJ recovered, David was the one who stepped up. Took personal responsibility for that kid. You say that like it's a good thing. I really doubt he was a positive influence. David's the reason the kid's better off now than, than he's ever been. You can be as mad as you want. About how, about how things panned out. The fact of the matter is, David's been good for AJ, among others. Clem is AJ's family. No kid is better off when you break their family apart. Maybe you're right. Maybe AJ should be with Clem. All I know is that he's better than he was when he got here. No thanks to you or David. I stand by what I said. If David's taken such good care of him, why did he tell me to ask you where AJ is? That's what this is about, then? You... You want to know where the boy is? What do you want? I... I just want to die. I want you to inject this into me. Are you crazy? That's just the way it is. When your brother found me, he... She got me to care about everything I'd given up on. My life. Other people. Even this goddamn place. Without him around. I don't want to care anymore. Just tell me where he is! Then you won't have any reason to do it. Javi, I have to know. I've been looking for too long. I can't lose him now. Not when I'm this close. 
All right. I'll do it. Well, where is he? He's... He's at the McCarroll Ranch. A few miles west of here. He's really alive. Don't forget to stick around to handle the after part. I don't want to become one of those monsters. Don't forget, Joan's looking for you and your friend. You better hope she doesn't find you. I've got it. Huh. Finally. Oh, hey. Uh, hi, Clementine. Surprised to see you here. Yeah, right back at you. You all good? Yeah, we're all set. Let's roll. <laughs> Good to see you. Javi, you're back. And Clementine. Thanks for the warm welcome. Just surprised to see you is all. Oh, hell. You okay? Yeah. It looks worse than it is. Don't worry about it. Kate's lying down in the other room for a bit. So you got the guns, huh? We got them, all right. One for you, and one for you. I saved this one for you. No, I've already got one. Actually, it wouldn't hurt to have another. <laughs> Thanks. What took you so long? We went to see Dr. Lingard. At night? I'm kind of surprised he was sober. It's got to be a stressful job. He's looking done, after man. an entire community? He was definitely not 100% there. That's for sure. Sounds about right. Why don't you go talk to Kate, OK? OK. The sun will be rising in a few hours. Joan's people know we're holed up here, and they're gonna come looking for us. All of us. Ah, for fuck's sake. Maybe it's not as bad as we think. Fucking figures. And there's no going anywhere with those things blocking our exit. They like me, that has to help somehow. Just because they like you, doesn't mean they're gonna like the rest of us. We're sitting ducks up here. We can't just wait around here to get shot, that's for damn sure. Hey, we can do this. Yeah. We've gotten out of tougher jams before, haven't we? I mean, sure, but this is different. We can't just cut and run, not with the herd out there. Like it or not, we're fucking stuck in Richmond. Now, how the fuck are we gonna put the brakes on this thing? Joan and her people are going to be at the square, right? We need to bring the fight to them. We go after Joan, our problems are solved. Great. So, how do we do that? It's a good question. Joan will probably have a full security detail with her. She'll be insulated from us and from anybody in Richmond who doesn't agree with what she's doing. If there are good people left in Richmond who are against what Joan's doing, we need to ask for their help. If we can talk to the people at the trial, present the case to everyone in Richmond, we might not have to do this on our own. We light the match, the people do the rest. After we take Joan out, we're gonna need some way out of this mess. I don't know about the rest of you, but I'm not much of a runner. We've got a truck, a big one that we used to use for walker defense. It's a little busted up, but it's way better than nothing. People are gonna be patrolling these streets looking for us. How far away is this truck? I'll show you. We've been expanding, pushing out further, making the safe zone even bigger. Can't promise you they've cleared all the walkers yet, but that's where the truck's parked. <laughs> I could spit and hit it. We steal that thing, nothing will be able to stop us. Steal what? 
Hey. Jesus, Javi, is that blood on your shirt? You said it wasn't that bad. It isn't. How the hell did this happen? Oh, you're bleeding right through that bandage. You should have told me as soon as you got in. It's not deep, it's just bled a lot. Besides, it's already taken care of. Clementine sewed me up back at the doctor's. You still didn't answer my question. What happened? He got stabbed, okay? By one of the guards. Thought you knew what you were doing. You're still alive, aren't you? Eleanor, can you take a look at this? As long as he keeps it clean, it should be okay. Would you guys stop making such a big deal about it? It happened. It's over. Move on already. <laughs> I'm just trying to make sure he's okay, Gabe. What we need to be talking about is the plan. Oh, I have a bunch of ideas. I want to be the one to go after Dad. Just give me a gun and I'll do whatever. I know the town. I know what Dad's going to be thinking. Hey, 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 slow down, would you? You're getting way ahead of yourself. Who's to say you're even coming along, kid? Are you fucking kidding me? Ugh, this is bullshit! I'm not staying behind. Gabe, take a breath. He's my dad. I'm going. It's going to be dangerous out there, and I don't want anyone else getting hurt. If we get to save dad, then getting hurt is worth it. It's worth dying for. This is more important to me than anyone else. I've got a gun, and I know how to use it. Could you do me a favor and stop showing off for everybody? You're tough, okay? You can handle a lot of shit. You don't have to prove it all the goddamn time. Nobody here is gonna let you be a martyr, Gabe. Your life is precious. Life is precious? Then how come you shot Conrad, huh? Back in the tunnel, when he came after us, he tried to bargain with you. I saved your life too, in case you didn't remember that part. So what? You shot him. You killed him. What the fuck, Javi? <sighs> is she telling the truth? You murdered my friend? What the fuck did you do that for? You looked me in the eyes, man. He had a gun on them. If I hadn't killed him, he was gonna shoot Clementine and Gabe. He's telling the truth. When Conrad found out that I used to run with New Frontier, he went crazy. He would have pulled the trigger, no question. I guess we'll never know, right? Because he's not here to tell his side of things. You made sure of that. Looks like you're a pretty fucking dangerous person to be around, Avi. First you kill my friend, then you get me and my friends on Joan's shit list? Oh my god. I think you need to give us some space, Javi. Fuck that. I don't want to see you ever again. Well, maybe I'd be better off with Joan. At least I know she wants to stab me in the back. You get the fuck out and you stay gone, or I can't be held accountable. You feel me? We can take care of ourselves. Hell, we stick around you much longer. You'll probably kill us, too. I'm sorry it happened the way it did. Really. Conrad wasn't a bad guy. The situation was just... just fucked. We better go get that truck. I'll, uh, get my stuff. Then call you on the walkie when I see things getting started <sighs> in the square. Oh, brother. Just when I thought Sarah number two was decent, he stepped like a hundred steps behind. Oh my god. Clem, you come with me to get the truck. Gabe and Kate, you guys hang back here. Be ready for anything. I see what's going on. You're punishing me because I told everyone what you did, right? Screw that. I'm going to get the truck. You stay behind and keep watch. You proved your fucking point already, Gabe. Now it's time to grow up and help us. Hey, Gabe, come on. I need you to watch my back on this one. Yeah. Okay. Oh my god. I guess god. somebody needs to be a lookout. What? 
Nothing. Gabe and I will be fine back here. Oh my god. Eh, fuck this kid. This looks like one of the areas Richmond is expanding into. This thing looks like it moves too slow for an escape. Sturdy, but only room for one. I guess they'll be using that for construction once they've cleared this area. What's going on? Thanks. For what? Helping out with Gabe. He's having a rough time. Yeah, we all are. I'm just doing what I can. Let's keep looking for that truck. You got it. There it is. Let's go. Chances. I'd say about 50 50. Smart ass. They say how long it's going to take for them to finish up here. People keep getting pushed onto up front. They're much behind. Hell yeah. This graveyard ship is killing me. Oh, let me get some of that. Early risers. Come on, we got to hurry and finish before more people wake up. What are we going to do? Can't start the engine, not without attracting a lot of attention. Kate, you steer. The rest of us are gonna get behind the truck and push. See if we can't get some distance between us and them. Ready? Ready. Ready. Oh fuck. It's a lighter's car, what the fuck? Turns out you needed me after all, huh? I'm just saying, I know you didn't want me to come along. If I'd stayed behind, maybe we wouldn't have been able to get the truck. You know, I'm just trying to keep you safe, don't you? Uh, yeah, but... But nothing. <laughs> You want to keep doing stuff like this, you gotta learn how to follow directions. Don't think those guys will be able to hear the engine all the way over here. I put it in neutral. Couldn't find an ignition key in there. Guess you'll have to hotwire it. Try not to shock yourself. Shit. I'll need something to strip the wires. They left all their supplies lying around. Bet there'll be some tools out there somewhere. Just try to hurry, okay? Oh, 
Oh, hurt. Shit. Almost there. Keep an eye out while I get it started, okay? I'll check on the guys in the office. Clem and I will look out for walkers. Okay. Here goes. should help with this. Gotta connect the battery to the ignition. Let there be light. Sarah number two looks like he's gonna run. Javi, hurry up. Don't get electrocuted. Don't get electrocuted. Hey, let's go. Squares a couple of blocks away. This is a good place to wait. Do we have enough gas? I'm not about to turn the engine off again. What now? We wait for Ava to call us on the walkie. So, nothing for us to do but sit and watch the sun come up. Well, I know we've got something important to do. I'm teaching you to play Euchre. <sighs> That's not a real thing. It's a card game. Come on, it's fun. It's nice to be driving around with a couple kids in the back seat again. It really we takes you back, doesn't it? Times it hurts to Just you and me and Gabe and Mari. You're right. This is nice. Like if I just close my eyes, we're right back where we were. All of us together. Do what I do. Try to think about the nice stuff. Not everything that happened after. <laughs> Gotcha. Oh, come on. That's not even a good rule. Still gotcha. Guess he stopped playing it cool with her. Hmm? Uh, in case you haven't noticed, Gabe's got a little crush on Clementine. Yeah. He like likes her. You get it? I hope it works out for them. I really do. They're good for each other. I think. Think their first official date will be target practice? Then skinning and eating a wild animal. Ah, uh, young love. It's so normal. Something's gonna you know? happen. Like, as crazy as things get, as terrible and tragic and just plain stupid, there's nothing more wonderfully ordinary as two kids falling for each other. Not that they're there yet. But to feel something that intensely for another person kind of like the best drug there mm. is is it bad if i kind of envy them those early days before you get up the courage to say exactly what's on your mind you never get those back do you no no you don't it's unfair that's all i'm saying that they're feeling what they're feeling right now and when that sun gets a little higher it's right back to the fight I just wish he could have had a childhood, you know? I wish I could have given them that. Him and Mari, both. They deserved better than this. That's why we're doing this thing, right? 
so he can have a better life after everything's said and done? You're right. I know you're right. I hope you know, Javi. Having you there with me, right by my side, all this time... That's what made the difference. You're so sure of what you're doing all this for. You didn't run away. You could have. I'm here so I can set an example for people. For Gabe especially. Someone to be proud of. Someone who sticks around. I get it. There's no graceful way to say this, so I'm just gonna say it. Oh shit, here we go. I know we've had moments. You and I. And they're always a little hot and a little confusing and maybe some of them haven't meant anything at all. But before whatever happens tomorrow happens, I need you to know whatever this thing is between us, I want to give it a chance. And I know the fact that David is back in our lives now makes this whole thing a little more complicated but do you feel the same way i'd really like to know before things get crazy we might not get another chance <laughs> no pressure or anything all right uh, let's go for it we gotta try right oh my god really really so are we gonna <laughs> okay. Yeah. Shit. We're doing this. You do realize we're gonna have to have a weird conversation with David, right? It's the right way to play this. He already got the sense I was pulling away. I just want to be able to tell him in person. It'll feel better That's that gonna way. Bank some us. That would be the stand-up thing to do in this situation. Can I just say how lame doing the stand-up thing is though oh it's super lame javi it's an execution over here she's planning to hang david in front of the whole crowd i knew it you've got to get over I here fucking now. knew it don't bring the truck if they see it they'll kill him right away if you can just get into the square shit we got to get over there now when they're putting those metal bars on the on the stage, my immediate thought was that they were going to start uh, hanging each one of them. I, oh my god, I fucking knew it. I'm going to hang back here, with the truck. Keep the walkie close by. We'll tell you as soon as we've got David. Oh, bro. Good luck. That is so Nothing else weird. For me, what the fuck? Nope. And it sounds like a crowd out there. Sounded like Ava got cut off by something. Or somebody. Wish we had some idea of what we're heading into. Like, is the okay, whole the plan shot? Or did she just have either. a little setback? I hate not knowing. Ava could be having problems with the walkie-talkie. Maybe it's out of range or ran out of batteries or something. Maybe. <laughs> We're not going to know what went wrong until we actually do this thing. So, let's do it already. <laughs> you ready? Ready as I'm going to be. <laughs> Glad to hear it. <laughs> That's just funny. Oh my god. David, he's going to blow up as soon as he finds out. Oh fuck. The people of Richmond deserve to be saved. David Garcia has to be punished for what he's done. Shit. We can't wait for the others, can we? For years now, Richmond has been governed by one simple principle. Strong council, strong community. But unfortunately, the actions of one of the members of that council our security expert, David Garcia, have put us all She's in... lying to all of you! I'm sorry to have to show you this. Truly, I am. But you all need to see. 
It's gonna be hard to convince Just them. Look what he's done. David ordered his brother and the rest of his people to kill our doctor. And they were happy to do it. Is this who we want in charge? Someone this reckless. Well, who's this the other person? Cruel? Not if I have anything to do with it. I can't believe this is really happening. She's gonna kill him. She can't do this to him. This is one. It's a scare tactic. He's kept him safe. I think she's bluffing. It's a scare tactic. There's no way she's really gonna execute David. Are you sure? I hope you're right. I'm gonna just say I'll that to there. him just so he doesn't blow up. I heard you were planning to crash our little party. But I feel like she will Why kill you him. Come on up here. Show your face to everyone. I'm sure these people would like to hear what you have to say. Happy to. Been waiting for this all day. Then I'll try not to disappoint you. We both know you killed Dr. Lingard. Why, Harvey? Why would you do that to us? The only surgeon in a hundred moment. mile radius, but you didn't care about that. Dr. Lingard had a problem. He couldn't stay out of his own supply. He asked me to put him out of his misery. I was only doing what he wanted. Sorry if I don't take your word for it. Too bad you killed the only man who could back up your story. She showed his uh, needle I had a scars. Very interesting conversation with your friend Eleanor last night. Isn't that right, Eleanor? We did. Oh, don't tell me she's red. She said you were coming here to rally the people against me, convince them that I was no good for Richmond. Oh my God! Don't know how you thought you were going to pull it off, considering. It's all of us against the three of you. And that's exactly what I'm planning to do. Appreciate the honesty, which makes this so much harder. Here in Richmond, people who put themselves before the group don't last long. Bring them out. Get away from me. You're making a mistake. Ava! Oh no, they had them this whole time. David wanted to tear this whole place down. He told his people where to find our gun supply, and sure enough, they picked us clean. You really thought you could ride into town and stage a coup? With our own damn weapons? Something like that? I can't just let it go. You've put me in a no-win situation here, so I'm gonna do the same thing to you. Both of them deserve to die for their crime. However, Javi, I'll let you spare. Oh, I'm picking Kyle. Just one. I'm pick no! Hell no! Don't! Don't! Not after what they tried to do. You may be guilty of bringing them into Stop this, game. but they chose to go along with it. Is this the kind of leadership you've got in store for Richmond? Torturing people with your stupid power games? Justice isn't a game, Javi. It's about time you learn that. Joan, are you sure about this? Whoa. We never agreed to killing all these people. It's really up to Javi, isn't it? Oh, shit. All eyes are on you. They're about to come. Maybe this will help you make up your mind. To my side. Boys. It's so close. Come on, Javi. Who's it gonna be? Your friend or your brother's <sighs> lieutenant? The person I'm gonna pick, I have a strong feeling she's gonna kill them. Oh, come on! This is fucking stupid. You can't be serious. God damn you, Joe. I'm gonna take. I'm gonna save Kyle. Oh, I don't want him to die, though. Do the right thing, Javi. How could you do this? <laughs> Fuck. Okay. Trip has to live. He's invaluable. Son of a bitch. Javi, what the fuck is wrong with you? You're not making David happy. But I respect you for sticking up for your own people. Shoot it. Ooh, Wait, I said I Trip should it. live. I knew you it. You did, but there's something else you need to understand. No. Betrayal. <laughs> you can't do this. Fucking figures. No, I Kyle. can do anything I want. You brought this on yourself. Do it. No. <laughs> you pay for it. How dare you? Wait. No. <sighs> no. Kyle. Oh, my God. They really shot him. 
damn it. Now, David, it's your turn. I can't believe this. This isn't how we do things. This is madness. Stop her, Clint. This is Bush a year. Stop her, Clint. Is this the process you trusted? No. Think about this, Hobby. You know what's gonna happen here. You ready for that? We don't murder in Richmond. We exile. That's how we've always done things. How about you take David and the rest of your people and just get the hell out? Go far away from Richmond, and then whatever you do is up to you. I'm sure the herd outside would like that. She thinks she's sending us out there to die. She's counting on it. Everybody, put your guns away. We're gonna handle this peacefully. <sighs> Don't listen to them, Hobby. They're fucking butchers, all of them. Shoot that bitch. Take her out. She deserves it. If you don't do it, I fucking will. Let me out of here. I'll tear her apart. We're leaving. All of us. Right now. I didn't say you could go. Doesn't matter if you did. This is how it needs to happen. any of you take your deal and shove it they're liars clint all of them one step closer and i kill him i swear i will go ahead and shoot them this. i think warned about your you they head. can't be trusted stop a second and think about this you think joan will agree to anything you say you trust her even for a second you're gonna end up like your friend over there <laughs> So we're just killing everyone then? <laughs> Fuck man, Kyle. You fucking hag! Get back here! Gabe, I need you to cover me. We gotta make things right. Oh, okay. Dad needs us. We gotta get out there. I hope and care. he doesn't need us. He needs you, not me. Go on. Thanks. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Bitch. Clown. Shit, I gotta help her. Hell yeah, anything for Clem. Fucking bitch. I knew David was gonna do something to fuck this up. I told you what he was like. When are you gonna start believing me? Shit, get down! I hear gunfire. What the hell is going on over there? Are you guys okay? I'm talking to get over here. We'll come to you. Do you need a pickup? Or do you have things under control? Stay away from the square. It's too risky. We'll come to you. I... I can't hear you. It's too loud. Don't tell me she's gonna die too. Kill every single one of them for killing Kyle. It's Kate. She's coming for us. 
fucking oh my god so fucking dumb i fucking knew that she was gonna do the opposite of what i picked oh my god <sighs> Alrighty, well sees uh episode five most likely we're gonna do that tomorrow um because i'm, I'm a little tired <laughs> so bye bye